Yeah, but uh, you know, this is still weird being behind uh, the commentators booth. I know. This was such a mysterious place for me until today. Oh uh, my god. Well, we're going to grand finals, and uh, who chose One Wing and Angel? Who whose boss music is this? You think? Uh, I think this was probably Carflow, right? I think so. Oh yeah. my god! Kill him. I feel like you know numbers is always the. Uh, the final boss, right? So. With one interaction from shield break to 65%. This character is weird. Even if John loses this game, he's won my heart. <laughs> Anybody who shields break is cool. All right, a good header, but no spike hitbox. Oh my god, that's that was really scary. I'm kind of shocked there no one hit either person. Yeah. Now, Carpool really... What? Okay, all right. John having to download. Doesn't really like playing against Krom, he said. And this is the reason why Karp... Well, Karpel has shown time and time again Krom is a good counterpick to Wii Fits. I mean, Krom... Unless they're off stage. Krom's neutral is pretty insane, right? So... And then you have the ledge... You have the ledge trapping that, you know, Krom, Krom is the same as Roy, right? Right. Maybe a little bit differently. Just because yeah. if uh, Wii Fit does get you off stage, there's no invincibility with that recovery. You do kind of have to be like, all right, fix it up. If not, I'm just going to get spiked. Or, ooh, so close to bringing John down. Oh, but no no tech from either of them. I know it's 1020, but uh, come on, guys. <laughs> you're stronger than this. Don't forget the tech. <gasps> Man, what a weird clash. I mean, what are we paying you guys for? They get paid? I don't know. I mean, they do get first and second. <laughs> who's going to take home the most money here tonight? Shout out to all the pot fillers, me included. Uh oh. All right, John with the nice low profile. Oh, it's something that he likes to use quite often, and he believes that he can just oh, mix no. things up. Yeah, that was that. They just oh. gave up. He's like, I think he burned his jump. He would have tried yeah, to recover otherwise. Together. That might have been what happened. I was very confused by that whole. Yeah, if we can actually see that last stock, I'm very confused of why he just kind of dropped like a lead balloon. So we see there, right? So he guts off. Oh! Oh, off, oh so he no. lost his jump oh, off the ledge. Oh no! Yeah. Oh, got double hit. There was nothing to do. As uh, that soccer two, ball has robbed one, more people go. than anybody that we represented at the Legal Aid Society. <laughs> Are we plugging Legal Aid now? <laughs> Always plugging Legal Aid. Be sure to pay your if public defense. If you're a defenders. criminal and broke, just uh, remember to call up your lawyer at Legal Aid. That's right. We'll get the one assigned to you. The next time you get caught hopping the turnstile. Actually, we can't do anything about that. Oh, yeah. I guess oh, you guys don't do violations or infractions? Not really. I mean, we could do like a summons, but I mean, it is like a ticket. <laughs> yeah. Like, you just kind of have to fight that in uh, like traffic courts. With that phone? Well, I know. some lawyer I was. <laughs> You can dispute it and be like, oh, you know, like I actually did it. The officer like didn't see me like, you know, swipe the card. You can ask for the records of the MTA for the card swipes because they do have that. But you know what? I would say oh. who has the better record here in Grand Finals, Carflow and John Numbers? I'd be so jittery to uh, edge guard as Carflow after how that last game ended. Yeah, so, but that's you what makes props for him for having that bravery that I will always lack. Hey, now, you two can be brave. You just got to, just got to, the there's a fine line between stupidity and bravery, <laughs> and everybody rides that at the top level sometimes. Well, I'm stupid and a coward, so... Damn. You'll never amount to anything. <laughs> but let's see who's going to amount to something here. Carflow still kind of uh, frustrated against John here, but uh, bringing this back as it's pretty much even stocks. They, ne they need to win two games. Two games! To reset the bracket, and John just needs to win this one to take the whole tournament. All those different looks just coming back on stage. I mean, just so many recoveries. So why she's a trainer? She'll train you to be ready for anything. <laughs> Production gets it. That's who we're. Uh, that's who we're riffing for. It's it's not the chat. That's right. It's it's the boys in the back. We support our boys in the back. All right. What are we gonna see here for a good recovery? Ooh. Not, no, they're still able to make it back. They have a chance. John able to reset the situation. Bringing that back. Oh, no. That was uh... <gasps> oh. 
Not a bad idea. John wasn't in a position above to actually spike, so Carpool might as well have gone for that suicide. I'm gonna get that damage. Let me see. Up air. Ooh, nice sliding forward tilt backwards. And a back air. Not sealing the deal. Oh my god, an excellent idea. Oh. But yeah, that's what's gonna happen. If you're below John and you're Krom, you're dead. Okay. But Carpool just needs one stock. All he needs to stay in this is one stock. And John is eyeing the end. Eyeing victory. But this is where, you know, John's at his best and then everyone gets tilted. Well, John's not quite playing from behind. He's on the winner's side. He needs to be last game resets to be a full strength. Well, but you know what? Maybe he doesn't full strength. Carful getting poked with the shield. Oh, batting the soccer ball away. Back to ledge. Jumps back on. No ledge re-grab. Getting deep, back on. Deep breathing's going to make them last longer. Oh my gosh, just a raw forward smash. <laughs> and John yeah. Numbers is your Xeno 313 champion. Let's work on your balance. John has no fear. You know, I, I think the big mistake is Carflow should have played Sheik. Do you really think so? Actually, no, Ike. That was the yeah. real yeah. crime. He lost, he lost the moral edge, you know, going back to, uh, to Crumb. I know. Like, like, once you become cool, reverting back to a state of uncoolness is not cool. Yeah, it's disgusting. It's really a dirty, rotten shame. Yeah. Uh, you know. But you know what? Anybody who comes out to Xeno Weekly, like, you know, whether you're an o tour, a one tour, or over here in Top 8, you are cool. You're coming out to your locals. You're supporting your scene. That, that's the best we can ask for. <laughs> yeah. Oh, what, do we have something uh, to say about that? No, no, I got nothing <laughs> to say about that. Uh, yeah, just come support, man. Come hang out. So. <laughs> now, honestly, that last thought caught us by surprise. Like, right there. I mean, just caught the jump. We just go back. Just waiting. And then just an empty jump. Probably. Oh, right. Oh, oh, gosh, John was ready just throwing that out. Because if it does a shield, it pushes you back just a little bit. And even John was a little bit surprised at their performance. Like, afterwards, you saw their eyes bugging out. Like, it worked. <laughs> it does. Hey. I wasn't ready to do shit. <laughs> <laughs> I always just do down tilt. I mean, oh, really? Let me write that one down if we ever play again. I, I think I have bigger problems than that against you. But. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. That's sweet, sweet grab. <laughs> oh, really? Okay, like Krom. All right, now if we can see the top eight bracket, I want to shout out everybody who's oh, made it over sure. here to podium place. See. I mean, obviously, John Numbers taking first place here. Carful coming in a very respectable, too. Hard fought over there in semifinals against Melly, all the way down to The Wire, who comes out in, in third place. El Rey start in fourth. Dill uh, and Joe J in fifth. And then Loot and Glutamate in seventh. Oh my god, I missed top eight again. <laughs> Because I lost to Glutamate. Wow. <laughs> oh, man. Imagine dropping the ball. Yeah. I mean, it's a tough bracket. To, to even make it a top eight, it's like, you're, you're pretty good. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no. But yeah, it's, uh, look, that's that's a stacked top eight every single time, right? So yeah. I'll take that. Even pool. Sometimes I'm just like, all right, who's my first match? <laughs> Loot. All right, who's my second match? Vaughn. I'm like, whoa, what's happening? But no, thank you so much for being here at Xeno Weekly. Let's uh, shout out a few little things here. We are obviously run by House of 3000, the premier, NYC's premier event coordinator when it comes to production of Smash and other community events. You can find them at all these lovely places here. If you're still on Twitter, check them out, uh, hashtag free ho 3 k And if you're on Blue Sky, the cooler Twitter, check them out at slash well, house of 3000.nyc slash blue sky. And then all these other wonderful places, the Discord, the YouTube, to catch all of your bonds that are recorded by the Quan stream. And be sure to subscribe and share the stream over at twitch.tv. But uh, over here, we have a look at this. What do you think about this, Dave and Busters? Is it time to go back? I wish I used those gift cards so this at is uh, this one. Literally tomorrow. Tomorrow? Uh, this is tomorrow. You have nothing uh, better so to do tomorrow, so the, go. The Dave and Busters at, uh, what is it? It's at uh, Atla the, Atla right? the Atlantic Avenue Barclay Center uh, one, so not the one in like Times Square or whatever. The one in uh, Times Square sucks. This is yeah, better. this one's uh, by default. So this one's better. tomorrow at 7 p.m. It's free entry. Uh, go to the link tree uh, on the screen. So that's link tree slash the legendary Wes. Yeah, this is hosted by uh, Wes. Um, because this is top on three has prizes. Um, but yeah.
come through? Now, if you check that out, the little asterisk right there, can we zoom in on that? No. Okay, what? 20 and younger must be accompanied by a parent or guardian. It is Dave and Buster's. Yeah. You're gonna see kids, so if you ever want to make somebody cry, that is your opportunity. <laughs> yeah, I, I think you can get like any additional like contact information just like on the uh, mm -hmm. link tree. So go for go go through that. But yeah, like I said, literally tomorrow, uh, go through free entry. All right, and what is not free, but you know, just as cool, bombs every single Monday, 7 p.m. right here at Zeno Zero. No pools, 64 player cap. And I, you know, some days it's the chillest grind fest. You can get as many friendlies as you want. Other days, everybody comes up because Brooklyn was canceled. This I think past it was more Monday because it was, was like absolutely Columbus bananas. Day. Everyone had off. Oh, that's fair. Oh, yeah. yeah, absolutely insane. People but, are like, bombs, yeah. bombs. Yeah, everyone was uh, back on their bullshit for that one for <laughs> sure. Uh, yeah, I, I, it was funny because like I tweeted out like all sets recorded. And then we had like mad people. I'm like, okay, maybe not all sets. <laughs> Most, Most sets. Most sets. Some sets. Yeah. But yeah, we still we do quad stream for bombs. It is straight bracket. Uh, so, and uh, yeah, everything is individually recorded and will be uploaded. It, bombs is a great event to like get your grind going. Um, yeah, you want and, some uh, practice? Yeah. This is the place to be it. And uh, you know, if you want uh, some other games in your roster. So this is next week. Uh, oh, no, not next week. Uh, this weekend, I guess. Yeah, so this is this weekend. Uh, TSB is going to be hosting one of their monthlies here at Xeno. They're doing Blast Blue, Guilty Gear Strive, Street Fighter Six, and uh, Guilty Gear Exerd. Uh, wow, Zerd? So, Hell yeah. Yeah, uh, so come through. I believe it's $15 venue and $10 entry for each game. Um, Start.gg slash TSB uh, will get you sorted. Um, yeah, uh, I, I, I invited them out. I'm like, hey, why don't you guys host one of your monthlies here? Uh, you guys can uh, use my setup and all that cool stuff. And uh, yeah, propaganda works. So come through uh, if you are into any of those fighting games. Uh, that's this Saturday, start to GG slash TSB. And if you like Street Fighter VI, then uh, is this Sunday the next Last Man Standing? Yeah, so this is the last Sunday of the month, so the 29th. Uh, and this oh. is going to be... Uh, Street Fighter 6, and I think uh, Mortal Kombat 1 as well. No way. I need to do some testing on the on my laptop since this event is all on PC. I need to do some testing on my laptop to make sure like MK1 is usable on it. Not that I think MK1 is like especially difficult or whatever, but like I just need to make sure. Do you have all the characters unlocked yet? I it's not my account, so uh -oh. I have no idea. All right. Um, I hope so. Uh, Big asterisk, yes. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so this is uh, Last Man Standing, Sunday, the 29th of October. $15 venue. It's a Swiss bracket, so you get to play a shit ton of bracket matches. Uh, and uh, it will, as once Swiss, Swiss will conclude into a top four, and then we do a, just a double elimination bracket from there for that top four. But yeah, uh, we've done as much as like, Six round Swiss, which means, you know, doesn't matter what level of a player you are, you are playing six matches. Uh, and yeah. um, to yeah, like. If you ever higher. feel like you want to see kind of how you stack against the best of the best and your fellow one, two, two tours, come on down. You're going to get so much practice. And everybody is super chill when it comes to Street Fighter. Yeah. But uh, you know what is not chill? <laughs> Where's the no chill? <laughs> the sweatiest bracket. <laughs> if you're trying to get good, come to Zeno every Wednesday. Uh, 7 p.m. start uh, for Wave A, 8 p.m. start for Wave B. Uh, $15 total, that's $8 venue, $7 entry. Um, yeah, start to GG slash Xeno. I'll always take you to the latest bracket, sign up, keep up with us on Discord, uh, houseofjones.nyc slash uh, Discord. Uh, follow me on Twitter, hashtag for you, HO3K. And uh, yeah, it's always streamed here. Uh, this also has a quad stream. We do more uh, like. Uh, more red zone style, so we call it the blast zone, and uh, so we have a you know commentary thrown into the mix, uh, and uh, it's a really good time. You know, tonight was a fun bracket, was a little bit on the smaller end, but you know, it's always top heavy. It's you know, regard no matter what. Um, so you know, yeah, small yeah. but mighty. Yeah, come through <laughs> on Wednesdays for New York's premiere. We come through. And then uh, back to us to close it out. Mishka, your first time on comms. How'd you feel and where can they find you? 
Uh, are going to do I it have, again. I have absolutely nothing to plug. No one should follow me on Twitter, although <laughs> oh, that is my Twitter, wait, Instagram Wait, hold on, I got handle. you. Wait, there, there we go. Yeah. yeah. Oh! My, perfect. Yeah, <laughs> my, my, my handle is just Elon Musk hate. Well, I mean, I guess you can follow me. For the, if you just want to see me retweet every bad thing imaginable about Elon Musk, then yeah, follow me at, That's very funny. at the Fasson Alum. Uh, it's not Twitter, political if you agree with Blue it. Blue Sky. Or it's, uh, it's, I don't know why people think that's me being political. The guy just sucks. So <laughs> I hated the guy before I, he became Republican. I love this. So, this is the yeah, long table. That's, the long that's my game. only plug. Since Devin said shit, I guess I could say fuck Elon Musk. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, that's the only reason I want to view comms. I will, I will happily commentate any of your local, despite not having a clue what I'm talking about, I'm dead. just so I can badmouth Elon Musk. You're going to go to so, Pace University, get yeah. some free pizza, right. get on comms, and be like, <laughs> fuck Elon Musk. <laughs> all right, all right, all yeah. right. <laughs> Then I'm Swiss Rider. Yeah. You can follow me on Twitter at Arnie Hermes. I'm on Blue Sky as well. Same tag, but I don't use Blue Sky as much. But I'm, I'm trying to transition. If, I, if I you want an invite, safe. hit us up in the Discord. I'm accumulating yeah. invites. <laughs> and like, uh, I yeah. have too many as well. Please come to Blue Sky. There's no reason to be on Twitter at this point. Yeah. Yeah, by the way, Frontline had a fantastic documentary. Do check it out on PBS Frontline on YouTube. Uh, it's very good. It's very good. So it just came out yesterday. But anyway, that's going to be it from us. Have a wonderful night, everybody. Thank you so much for supporting your locals. And we'll see you next week right here at House of 3000 and Xeno Zero Gaming. Peace out, everybody. Bye.